Um, my name is Chris Kowalski. I uh, was a police officer prior to retiring. Did that for 24 years. Now I live down here in Ockham. My name is Erica Kowalski. I worked for the school district for about 10 years. We wanted something that was warm. We previously lived in Utah, so we wanted something that was warm year round. We started looking at different places and fell upon this place through doing our research. And we hardly have free time because we're so busy. I play pickleball almost every day, um, play in a band. Um, I have a play video games, go to the pool, go to the ocean, hang out with friends. I thought we'd keep busy to a certain point, but at this point, I think we're busier than we expected. Yeah, for sure. It was kind of to get people um, more involved in it. There's this kind of mentality that they think you're coming to Mexico and you're going to die. We wanted it to be more uplifting, not to be afraid, to step out of that normal circle that you're usually in every day and experience something new. We usually try to keep people updated with the different kind of experiences we've had here. Um, and kind of just, we're, we're also being educated as we're going and we want to let our followers know, okay, you may encounter something, this is how we dealt with it, because you, everybody's uh, <clears throat> whole situation varies. I think, in our opinion, if you're able to purchase before you move here, um, do that if you're able. Also, just start learning the language. Now, if you can buy a place before you move down here, then you can see what things you can find here. You can find most things here, but some of it's not the same quality as back in the States and I assume Canada. Um, so if you move down or you get a place down here first and you can start you know, muling stuff down there, you're probably going to need this. It's going to be hard to find. Get more people involved. Yeah, definitely. More reach, the barrier. reach more people and hopefully get people excited about it.